uh, let me start by saying um, I finished the second season and I absolutely loved it. It is so, so good. I don't think fans are ready for how good it is. I think they're, they're just going to love it. For you guys, have you just been with, like counting the days till you can actually talk about specifics? Yeah, people ask you all the time, like, yes, yeah, so what can you tell us? Is there anything you can actually tell us, like some little thing? And it's just like... We have had to say yeah. no so many yeah. times. So I'm very yeah. excited. We don't want to just... diminish their experience of the... Exactly, the, yeah. exactly. Right. Like, saying something would diminish yeah. their experience. So it's kind of like, you know, just get it. Finally, it's out there, yeah. and they can just watch it and know what's up. One of the things I think that's really cool about Stranger Things is that you guys work with different directors. The Duffers started, they, they bookend. You have Sean Levy, Andrew Stanton, which is crazy. Yeah. Andrew, well, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, so yeah. I'm, I'm curious if you could talk a little bit about working with the different directors on the series and maybe how they're different, how they're the same, and maybe what it's like filming two different episodes on the same day that might have different directors. Mm. Well, it's convenient because in the block schedule, they actually, the directors will have the two episodes that we're shooting at the same time. So you'll never have two different directors on the same day, which is nice. Um, but, I mean, obviously it's amazing, and it's kind of crazy how they all can make this cohesive tone that the Duffer Brothers have created while, you know, bringing their own things to the show, I guess is what I have to mm. say about it. Yeah. It was my first time working on television. Did I cut you off? No, 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 no. I just said uh, that. It was my, my first time working on television, um, so it was really interesting for me. The narrative is so much more drawn out, and you're right, you're coming in and out of it. Even if you're shooting two-episode right. blocks, Definitely. you might be, you know, however many days ahead and then back and forth. Andrew Stanton, Sean, Matt and Ross, all the directors were incredible um, and each brought something unique to the plate. They all have such established and c concrete careers and have done all kinds of amazing things. So I just kind of went to set and tried to act like a sponge, soak up as much advice and, um, and things as I could. So it was pretty amazing to have a diverse range of people. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, I, you guys covered it pretty well, but yeah, I, I totally agree to the point where, you know, the Duffers have, are very, hands-on with this whole project you know they, they write they direct they edit all that stuff so they're very close to it but you know having you know Sean and Andrew on um, you know doesn't diminish the integrity of what they've created it you know enhances it in very unique ways that maybe you didn't think about so yeah. that's fun yeah I I, uh, I was very impressed with what Andrew did for his first time uh, directing, but then again, the whole series is so good. Mm. Uh, let's talk about the most important thing, which is your look on yeah, the show. Definitely. I mean, it's <laughs> we have to get into it. The Canadian hair. tuxedo. Yeah, we we, yeah. we got to get into the, it. So, how much is that? The earring. The... Mm. Yeah. Right. So how much is? <laughs> Love it. How much is that? The costume department. How much is that? You working with the costume department? Uh, so three names. Amy, Sarah, and Kim. That's all HODs of all those departments. Huge hats off to those three. And, and everybody Ladies. else. Wigs but, off. But, uh, yeah, wigs off to those guys. <laughs> uh, no, I think it, between the wig and the jean jacket and everything, it was it's an incredible space to, to function in. I feel very fortunate. It's very different from myself. Um, <laughs> I remember I, you showing up and being like, what? Yeah, I love it. I love it. Um, yeah. So, yeah, little things like on that jacket, if you'll notice, there's a little uh, a lipstick... Uh, imprint on the the lower half of the collar, um, and uh, and that was something that we added. And oh, the, um, ring, the attention to detail. The, the watches, the... yeah. I went through. I think a lot of that that the the rings and things the that was stuff that we sort of. Did, there's a little uh, scorpion keychain for the Camaro, and um, but the jeans, the jeans were customized, <laughs> yeah. tight <Yeah>. bum. <laughs> Yes. Uh, one of the things I think that's great about the season, the second season, is that it, it feels like everything's amped up. The action's even better. Just the character stuff. It, it's just really well done for all of you guys. What was it like? How many of the scripts did you get in advance? How much did you know about the arc of how everything was going to go? Didn't know it at Didn't first. Probably got two, and then two, and then two, and then one, and then two. It was like pretty much like throughout. You're kind of like, what happens? Because it's kind of. Yeah. Kind of hard exactly. also, at, you know, it's nice if you get a script for a film because you, you read the whole thing, you know where you start, you know where you end. But this, you're kind of like, well, I don't know what... Yeah. So it's, you know, helpful in some ways and can kind of be, uh, you know, like, like you just want to know in other ways. Um, so, I mean, for the most part, I feel like we're like the audience, you know, waiting around for the scripts and then waiting for it to come out just like everyone else. It's like, you know, we're kind of along for the ride. Well, do the Duffers pull you aside at the beginning and give you any sort of hint as to where the season's going to go? Like, how much are you told about the arc? And how much is it you guys getting those scripts and being like, okay, so what, what's going to be happening? 
moment. Pretty hush-hush hush 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 about it. Yeah, pretty hush. Pretty hush yeah, about it. I mean, we, you they, can they, they, they like to, like, give a, I think occasionally they'll drop a little, like, this might happen. Yeah, maybe. drop a little hint. You know, yeah, guys, yeah. come on. But they don't, they don't actually confirm yeah. anything until the scripts come out, and they go yeah. through Netflix and everything. Just because I think it's a little bit more trouble just to tell people something, and then if it changes, then it changes. And right. It's like and it, just putting yourself in that situation is probably no fun, so... Yeah. I have to ask you also another important question. Who do you think would win between a fight between the younger kids in Stranger Things and the kids of It? Well, you have to mm. subtract Finn from both because they would just fight each other. So cancel each other. I would say numbers wise, they would have yeah. Stranger Things beat just uh, because there's. Yeah. You know, but they're kids. also they seem they're the kids in It of like way. Yeah, they yeah. seem. Sorry, guys. Yeah. I, mean, I think I think they do pretty. I mean, they don't have the pa- like Millie doesn't have. That's if you if you include Does Millie have, though. You know, I mean, I stuff? if that if Eleven yeah. is part of that crew, then I think is it like the fictional characters shot? or real kids? I, I would say real kids. Oh, oh the real I mean, kids. It, I'm sorry, <laughs> sorry, our guys. But I think you might die. Um, my, uh, when you compare it to the make, you weren't on season one, mm-hmm. but for you guys making season two, like how did it compare on set? Maybe versus making the first season because the first season you're operating in like a void. You don't know if this is going to be good. You have no idea what the final result will be. Yeah. So what is it like on the second season, knowing huge hit and there's a lot of fan expectation? Yeah, I, I have to say I didn't quite feel like the, I wasn't too nervous about that or thinking about that so much while we were filming. You know, and I think we have a lot of trust and the Duffers and the creators inherently just because they're really good at what they do and it's mm. very obvious. Um, but I think I don't know. I didn't. I didn't really start to like get nervous about the reception of season two until we were kind of wrapping it up and towards the end, and then realizing like, oh man, like what is how is this? Yeah, this is. Gonna I mean, come I it's, out. it's and for the first season, it was kind of like we yeah. all like it. We hope you guys like it. We hope that it's well received. And I was like, I really, I really do like it. You mm. know, and it's you just you never know. You never know when you throw it out there what mm. people are gonna, how they're gonna react. But I feel really good about it. Yeah, I mean, maybe you feel like a little bit of pressure down there, but not really. It's just like, once you get back on set, it's like, oh yeah, we're back here. Oh, this is great. And it's then so you get to, too. you know, a very, a very like uh, relaxed uh, feeling on set. Not very stressful at all. Again, congratulations. Thank people you. are going to oh. fucking love it. Thank, oh, thank you. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you.